We want to get back to the breaking news we brought you at the very top of the show of a massive fire happening right now in Mooresville. NBC Charlotte's Tanya Mendes. I know you just got to the scene. She's joining us live this afternoon. What can you tell us at this point? So we're standing actually at the end of the street where this fire broke out. You can see the home sits at the top of the cul-de-sac in a neighborhood with houses that are upwards of a half million dollars. This home now reduced to a skeleton. You can see all the smoke in the air choking out the sky. A number of firefighters still on scene. We've counted more than a half dozen fire trucks in the area. Mutual aid got brought in. We've seen different agencies, at least three or four here. Um, they've been on the scene now for several hours at this point, at least a couple of hours, because this call came in sometime after 9 o'clock. This fire still, though, not under control. Um, my colleague, Reed Bennett, he's showing you down the street because this road is totally blocked off. They're not letting cars in and out, neighbors not being allowed back into the neighborhood. They said the reason why is because there's just so many firefighters that are still having to come and go from this scene. Also, these attack lines, this, this yellow hose that you're seeing, they string all the way down the street and up and around the corner. That's how much water they're having to pump into this neighborhood right now to try to get this home under control. At this point, we don't know the cause of the fire. We're seeing a number of firefighters, investigators who are continuing to walk in. You see more walking in right now in front of me. Um, very active scene still. We're being asked to stay here at the bottom of the street. Very heavy smoke. And again, this home, we're told there was a partial collapse in the background. And certainly all we see right now appears to be a skeleton of the front, the shell of the home that still remains. We're going to stay here on scene and continue to work this story and find out the cause. And if there's anything else that we can share with you and bring you the very latest as we get it. Reporting live in Mooresville, I'm Tanya Mendes, NBC Charlotte. Tanya, thank you. And that street is Misty Meadows sure. Court for anyone that's in that area. It is closed right now. We'll continue to bring you the very latest on this uh, story as it develops and as Tanya learns it. Make sure you have our WCNC app as well for those updates.